The QuickPay to MicroPay converter enables you to take payrolls you have been running in QuickPay and convert them into one or more MicroPay payrolls. Before you proceed any further, there are a few preparation tasks that you need to complete in both Sage QuickPay and MicroPay. To check for any available updates within your software, click Help, then check for updates. If the following window appears, there are no updates available to install. If you are prompted to install a QuickPay update, please do so now before proceeding any further. During the migration process, the converter will need to know where your program files are held for Sage QuickPay. To check this now, click Help, then System Information. Under the section Program Directory, make a note of the path. For the conversion to work, you can't save any timesheets in the current pay period of your QuickPay payrolls. You can check the status pane at the bottom of your QuickPay payroll. If this is reading time and pay calculated, then you've already completed processing in the current pay period, and you must set the next pay period before you can do the conversion. Once you've ensured that this payroll is at start of start of period, please log into any other QuickPay payrolls that you have that you wish to migrate, and make sure that they are also at start of period. If you intend to merge a number of QuickPay payrolls into a single MicroPay payroll, you must make sure that the payrolls are all on the same computer or network location. You can check where the payroll data is located by clicking Help, then System Information. Log into each of the QuickPay payrolls and make sure that this path is the same. Next, you need to make sure that all the QuickPay payrolls share the same tax year and pay frequency. They must also have the same tax registration number and be on the same pay period. To check your QuickPay dataset for any issues, go to Reports, then Validate Payroll Data. If any issues appear on this report, you should print it and rectify them before proceeding any further. To back up all the payrolls in your QuickPay software, first log into one of the payrolls. Then from the menu bar at the top of the window, select Miscellaneous and Backup. Select the option Full System Backup. Then browse to the location where you want to take the backup. Click OK. Select the payrolls that you wish to backup. And also select the common files. You don't need to select programs. To start the backup process, click OK. Once you receive the following prompt, the backup is taken successfully. Click OK to close. To download your new copy of Sage MicroPay, go to mysage.ie. Next, enter your email address and password that you use for your Sage login. If you don't already have a Sage login, Click Create a Sage Login to set one up now. And if you can't remember your password, click Forgot your password to reset it. To continue, click Sign in. If you're linked to more than one account, please select the account you want to download the software from. Once you've successfully logged into MySage, from the toolbar at the top of the window, select Support and then Download Software and Updates. From the drop down list, Select the software you want to download. In this example, it's Sage MicroPay. Then from the full downloads, find the latest version. To begin the download, simply click the download icon. Depending on your web browser, you may be prompted to choose a location to save the download. We recommend that you save the file so that you don't have to download it again if you ever need to repeat the installation process. When it's finished downloading, you're ready to install the software. Once you've installed Sage MicroPay, you need to log into the software and set up the payroll users. 
at the login window, enter the username admin, enter the default password pass. You can change this once you've logged in. Once you've successfully logged into Sage Microfi as the system administrator, in the menu bar at the top of the window, select security and then users. Click the add button and enter a payroll user. Select the default group one. If you want to set up a password for this user, click change password and enter the relevant information. Repeat this process for any other payroll users you want to set up in Sage Microfi. To save the payroll user settings, click OK. You've now completed the preparation tasks and are ready to migrate your QuickPay data 